been been a pretty hectic schedule so far. So uh, just looking after ourselves, you know, we'll get back into it tomorrow and get cracking and get ourselves ready for uh, Melbourne next week. JL was pretty glowing in his sort of praise of you. Like there's a lot of people coming out saying, you know, you're the find of the tournament. And JL was saying, you know, it's not long before, you know, the Australian selectors will start looking at your performances. How, how do you take that on board? Um, I'll take it as it comes. From people saying it to me, it's people say it to me is I just sort of take it on board and say, yeah, give myself a little pat on the back, but continue to focus on my job. I don't, don't try and let that sort of affect me too much and just sort of go out there focusing on getting the win for the Scorchers. Vogsy, the captain, showed good faith in me. Um, he he let, it, let it made clear to me that what my role in the team was and that was good of him, so then I could just focus on going out there and doing what I do. And with Nathan, looks like he might come back this week or he's going to play some role um, towards the end of the season. Do you feel like there's a pressure for spots there? You know, Nathan's coming back, but everyone seems to be bowling so well. Do you feel the pressure? Uh, not really. You know, at the end of the day, if, oh, I've done all I can do. And if, if they still feel that Nathan will take my spot or if he takes someone else's spot, well, then that's the way it is. You know, it just means you go away and work harder and hopefully you uh, get that spot back again. It's nice to have Sean back in the group as well. Yeah, very handy. You know, he's a very good T20 player. Um, as, as noted, he was one of the leading run scorers in one of the IPLs. Scored a lot of runs last year as well. So, yeah, very, very handy addition to our batting lineup. And the stars coming up, they're obviously going to be missing a few guys, but still a, a pretty good team. Yeah, they are a very good team. They've got a very couple of dangerous players with uh, Luke Wright and Kevin Peterson at the top of the order. They'll still have John Hastings... Boland with the ball and you know every team we've played this year has been a difficult team um, they've got a lot of dangerous players so we'll just focus on what we do um, score a score or restrict them to a score and then chase them down or hold them back so you know that's all we can focus on if we can control what we can control and that's all we can do.